Healthy by Chado, um, MMM, me, myself, and medicine. Um, if you're new here, my name is Beauty, and if you came back again, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for coming. Don't forget to like, to subscribe, and leave a comment in the uh, comment section. So in today's video, we're going to be doing what in my bag, the DH um, edition, dissection haul edition. So I'm going to be showing you guys what I actually carry in my bag whenever I go to the dissection hall. <sighs> so I really don't know if, okay, but uh, anyway, let's move on. So yeah, I just hope, um, I know I haven't been consistent lately guys, cause like you, um, my school work, it, it, it keeps on piling up. So I have to prioritize what's important. I'm not saying this channel is not important. It is important, but you know, I have. This channel won't write exams for me. This channel won't read for me. So yes, I only shoot when I get the chance to do that. Yes. So let's get on with the video. So this is my bag. This is a bag that I use um yeah i used to use um like small bags or like handbags to go to dh or even class um until they they broke okay so that's where i decided i should buy something that is much more stronger and that can actually be able to carry the weight of the books that i read yes so china and only please guys stop going with your Stop going with your handbags to class and come buy this. Come buy this. This is for medical students. What you're holding is not for medical students. Anywho, let's continue. So if you want this bag, I bought it from Medicine Medical Supply. You can go check them at Medicine Medical. Is it Medicine underscore Medical underscore Medical underscore Supplies? Yes, I will leave the thing on the screen down there. Yes, go check them on Instagram. And yes, you can be able to get yourself a nice bag in different colors. Yes. So, I'm going to be showing you guys what it is actually in my bag whenever I go to the age. So, let's start. So, the first thing that is obvious that you have to go to the yeah, is... I'm not putting it that way. It's this book. It's the Atlas, the Anatomy of Human. The Atlas of Human Anatomy. Yes, so it's one of the most important things that you have to carry when you go to your dissection hall. Because it like directs you when you're dissecting what is what and what not it. What what is not what. You see that's English. Yeah, so I carry this with me. I used, I used not to have my own atlas and I would struggle to get one from the library because everyone wants um, an atlas and all of that. So I bought this. You can also, if you want an atlas, you can go check at Medicine Medical Supplies. Yes, as well. So I'm carrying this with me and it belongs to me. It's my own. I didn't borrow it from wherever. Okay. Second thing that I carry with me, it's this atlas. So, so this one is another atlas as well, but this one is a color atlas. So that when you open your cadaver, you can be able to identify that this is this, this is this. Because sometimes when you're using this atlas of pictures, cartoon pictures, you cannot really be able to identify what is what, what is which. On this book, uh, obviously the veins and your arteries, they appear, some are green, some are red. So, in real life, the veins are not blue, your arteries are not red. They are like, more or like the same. Yes. So, I also carry this with me to the dissection hall. Uh, I don't know if I can show you guys the inside because it's kind of scary. So, yeah, let me show you the inside. I don't want this video to be horror 101. Yes. Okay, the next thing that I carry with me, <coughs> it's a dissector manual, it's a dissector. So this one, it has instructions on how to actually cut the cadaver. Yes, it has instructions 
on how to cut the cadaver in the version. It's very important and this also it belongs to me. I bought it to these guys like yeah. It's a struggle to get a book from the library, by the way, like it's a struggle. I hope the birds outside are not making noise because I can feel that when they're irritating. So I just hope but obviously the god so guys, whatever it's in the background sound are uh, the birds. Yes, they are the birds. Yes. So yeah, as I was saying, I carry my dissector with me to the dissection hall. Yes. And the other thing that I carry with me to the dissection hall is this book. Small iPad. I call it an iPad because it's small. I don't know what an iPad is, but I call it my iPad. Yes. I carry this to the dissection hall because obviously they won't allow you to use your phone to note things and stuff and I don't want that big book that's going to be lying on the cadaver and the next thing I come with it here I'm going to put my bread on it and I'm going to eat this so what I actually do with this book is I note what is actually important or what we have seen on our cadavers so I know to be here or maybe the day before going to the dissection hall like I note like a few things that I really have to note when I get there because you guys like you know it's tough like you know the cadaver like it's tough everything is just the same everything is brown Everything is just the same. Sometimes you cannot even see naps, you cannot see your vessels, you cannot see anything. Yeah, so yeah, this is why I carry this. So this one, it helps me identify important structures and what is actually not important. Yeah. So, yes, I think that is all from the big part. Let's see. I also have my pen and my I have my pen and my pencil. Obviously, you have to carry a pen and pencil. I used to carry like the whole, the whole box of pens and <clears throat> pencils, but they keep on. I keep on missing that. So I figured I should just carry one pen and one pencil. Yes, and that is what I use to write whatever that I want to note. And you guys won't believe what I have again. I have this. This is a mascara. I don't know why I have a mascara in my school bag, but anyway, I have it. And the worst part is, okay, I also have my, my matte lipstick in this one. Guys, I really don't know why I carry these things in my bag, like to be honest, I don't know why I carry them, because I don't use them. Like, if I put any gloss, because even these days you wear max, so really you don't have to, but I do it anyway, and you do, so yes, so I carry this, but anyway, I don't use them. You never know. Maybe after the section horn, I might decide to go on out on a date, so you know, y'all must be ready. <laughs> so yes, guys, I think that is all that I have in my bag. It's nothing fancy, really. It's just like the books and... Whatever it is, whatever it is. Okay. Yes, so that's what I have in my bag. You know, like I used to get you, I used to hate going to the dissection, to be honest. I used to hate going to the dissection. Like going to the dissection hall was like my worst, like like the day that I would have to go to the dissection hall would be the worst day of my life. But to be honest, these days I enjoy going to the to the to the to the DH guys. Like, oh you know what guys, my group it's it's just on another level like it's on another level my group that is making the pots to be honest i feel like i'm learning a lot from them like we are learning a lot from each other so i think this is what makes the head to be interested in this is I, I, like i never thought i'll ever enjoy going to the age and like this is when i'm there like the time seems like it's flying before i know it they say guys pick up it's time up and like you know, guys i'm still enjoying the pot Yes. But the spotter, which is a test, does really care whether you enjoy the deep inch or you don't. If it moves you, <laughs> it will move you, it will show you things. But anyway, that's a story for another video. So guys, um hopefully this video is gonna be short. So because this is all I wanted to show you what's in my bag, nothing fancy, obviously. So yeah, guys, um thank you so much for joining me and yeah. For me, 
No, I'm not done. I'm not done. I'm not done. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, to subscribe, and leave a comment down below. As I said, these days I might not be too consistent because I have a lot on my plate, but I will try to shoot as many videos as I can so that I can be able to upload as I promised. So.